temptation. It's been around for since, well, ever. Christians all know about the story of Eve and the original sin. How the snake lured Eve into eating the forbidden fruit and how Eve lured Adam into doing the same. But what about today? What about the Cedar Crest community? I have asked various people on the Cedar Crest community one loaded question. What tempts you? <laughs> I'm Barb Farley and it's Academic Services. What tempts me? Oh, a lot of things in this office. Of course we have a lot of students that deliver baked goods and sell them and then we also put out a lot of candy. Students love that too. Pastry. <laughs> Basically anything sweet. Dove dark chocolate. I'm almost invulnerable to desserts, but dove dark chocolate uh, has a certain hold on me. Raisinets. Raisinets, Pez. Well, Pez was my addiction when I was a kid. Chocolate. Probably the thing that tempts me the most would be chocolate. I really love chocolate. Um, a bowl of M&Ms with all the bright colors. I usually can't walk by that without grabbing a few and then maybe a few more, maybe till the bowl's empty. Probably um, a bag of potato chips when I have them in the house and I'm only going to eat a few and I go away from them and know that they're there and I just wait, you know, finish the bag. Candy, cookies, and a cute guy with long hair and lots of money and a nice car. It's always a plus. Beautiful women tempt me <laughs> all the time, get me in trouble now. I'm a good kid, very monogamous. Really hot guys. When it's a really nice day outside, if I'm working inside, you know, my thoughts are like golf, frisbee, frisbee golf, uh, anything but being in here. Relaxing on the beach on a hot summer's day. What tempts me is to do things um, not necessarily the right way, to take shortcuts, to, um, to go through things faster than I need to, especially when I'm tired, like Friday afternoons when it's the end of the week. You can kind of rush right through working with students and just get them done really fast. I am, you know, when it's a chance to, to get outside when it's nice. Um, I like gardening. Um, it's always tough in the spring at the end of the semester when the ideal gardening time is the same time as writing final exams and grading final exams and doing other final projects and things. So getting outside, uh, working out where it's nice, taking a walk with the dog, things like that. So I'd say getting outside and enjoying nature is probably my biggest tempt. Beautiful weather tempts me to skip class. <laughs> That uh, spring fever and that senioritis hits pretty, pretty heavily when there's a beautiful sunny day out. So nice weather definitely tempts me to uh, ignore responsibilities at times. My comfy chair, my bed where I can just lay down and not have to worry about my schoolwork. The promise of adventure. What tempts me? Um, my Sims game on my computer so that I can avoid work and get a little downtime. Uh, my latest temptation is iTunes. Uh, ever since I got an iPod, I've been downloading music for the past two years. And uh, that is probably my worst temptation because I probably download about two to three songs per week. Let's say music because I like acting a fool. I like daydreaming. and. In songs, you can daydream and act a fool, and I don't know, it gives me freedom to express myself. If I go shopping in a shopping mall, that's usually what tempts me the most, is buying uh, new clothes, um, books, CDs, things like that. Books, books, books tempt me. I will kill someone for a book. I would have to say cute baby animals. When I see them, I want them. Pro football is one thing. Uh... It's violent, overall stupid, but I still watch it a lot. <laughs> As you just saw, the Cedar Crest community has a wide range of temptations, just like the community itself. So what are your temptations? 